Hey, what's up, dudes? KublaiKhan here, and welcome to Fallout 4 Patch Talk. Patch 1.3 has recently come out for Fallout 4 and has an incredibly interesting feature included, which is the ability to look at your settlers and see what jobs they are assigned to. So by opening up the settlement menu, we can now look at a settler and see in the top right of the screen an icon indicating what they are doing for your settlement. You can see people are in defense and food, and you can even see highlighted what they were specifically assigned to. This is fantastic. It keeps the settlement running most efficiently, and it also points out people who are being lazy. Marcy Long is being lazy, and that really bothers me because we're in a settlement. We're in the future. We need to protect our society as a whole, but we can't have people freeloading now it is important to root out insubordination wherever it is found. And in the case of Marcy, her form of laziness is insubordinate behavior. So first you want to do is isolate her from the rest of the settlers. I highly recommend using things like cattle fencing. This allows various bugs, rats, and lizards to slip into her enclosure. That way she knows that she can't escape, but everything else can see her and live in the same enclosure that she must deal with. Now we are animals, of course we're gonna give her a place to sleep. I also like my form of tortures to involve symbolic representation. This bed sucks, it's cold metal, basically pieces we found off the wasteland, and we wanted to put it to some place where she can experience it and realize that that's what life would be like if we didn't work together. Now, also along the lines, I wanna share with her something that represents us working together. That is the porcelain god, the toilet, a place where she can use and experience and relieve herself comfortably rather than just upon the floor of her enclosure. This is to have the clashing ideals, her feeling of stress of not working with this feeling of success. Now Marcy's been in here for a couple of days, so I thought I would come over, turn on my spotlight and interrogate her. So Marcy, could you tell me how do you feel about the organization now? I'll hand it to you. This place isn't awful. It's still a hole, but it could be worse. That's fantastic to hear, Marcy. I'm very glad to hear you come around. However, everybody's been talking, and we're all really excited to demonstrate what happens when somebody doesn't pull their own weight. Now, who here wants to get the first shot? What? And we bring you here today, from the skies, to enjoy the view of Settlement Sanctuaries rehabilitation process. As you can see, we deliver high velocity shells of rehabilitation that come exploding into one's soul. It is a good feeling, a good thing for today. Oh, look at our cannoneers preparing their firing onslaughts. We are most proud of their dedication to saving those who fail to continue their work. Ah, uh, back to the camera cam, enjoying the explosions and consistent kaboodles. Kaboodles and oodles of glory. Now, if you notice her body flinging through the air in this shot, don't worry about it. She's actually totally fine. Like most characters in Fallout 4, she's immortal. And this is a video game. Everybody's happy here, having a good time. It's just all about improving civilization's efficiencies. So thank you for stopping by. I hope you enjoy Fallout 4 Patch 1.3 with the ability to see what the hell your people are doing. Thus, you can create the most efficient civilization and society. Thanks for coming by, dudes. And of course, may the ground rise to meet your feet. May the wind always be at your back. And may the sun shine warmly on your sexy, sexy face. Bye. Hey, if you guys liked what you saw, go ahead and put a little like in the corner, and if you want to subscribe, go ahead and click on the explosion that's currently making Marcy a stronger, better worker. And if you want to see more Fallout 4, go ahead and check out the Permadeath Roleplay playlist that I have just to the bottom right of this page. This is where I take builds where you guys submit to me, and I play them out, and if they succeed, awesome Hall of Heroes, and if they don't, well, then they're cut and we start someone new. And of course, we just got other fun goofiness, so check out that playlist up there. Alright, dudes, see you later. Bye. Man, they're just gonna keep shooting her, aren't they?